Robin Sylvester. Yeah, come on. Alice Cooper, <laughs> in the uh, Laurel Canyon, in his house, sitting by the pool, uh, always him and his pen, paper, and me and my guitar, mm -hmm. and trying to come up with a concept for an album. Mm -hmm. And we were having some problems. Um, we had written a couple of songs. One of them was a song called Only Women Bleed. But that was before the concept really came about. That was a song about domestic violence. So we're still trying to come up with something that would be, uh, we would tie all the songs together in a story. And uh, we were there, at, always writing at the pool, but there were always like four or five girls around there, and they're all topless. <laughs> <laughs> and it became, it's a bit of a distraction. We're trying to catch the right. You know, got these young ones. Some of them had bottomless too, and they're just walking around. <laughs> it sounds like tough times. <laughs> it was terrible. You know, so we had to really Very distracting, hard to work. We really had to, we had to go somewhere else to write, so yeah. we went to the Bahamas. That's why I enforced a new okay. dress code here. So. Uh -huh. <laughs> so we just had to go to the Bahamas. Well, it keeps getting... Yeah. We rented a place on the, on the ocean in the Bahamas. And uh, it was lovely. I mean, there was a beautiful lawn out in front of this house. And then there was the beach and the ocean. And it was just idyllic weather. So we'd go out in the morning on these two lawn chairs. And once again, the pad and the paper and the, and the guitar. And uh, we were out there one morning. We're still searching for a concept, trying to come up with it. But one morning, we were out there, started, started writing, and then a tropical storm started coming up. And my mouth was getting dry. Shame. This doesn't happen to me when I'm in front of a big audience. But. <laughs> There's a picture, actually, in the book of around that time of him and Alice writing this, pro this album, probably, or maybe it's another album. Point it out because it's really cool. Anyway, continuing with the story, this tropical storm started coming up. And within 10 minutes or so, it was like 50 miles an hour winds. And it was just, here were these two fools sitting there, long haired fools sitting out there with the wind blowing. We were even trying to talk to each other through the wind. And the skies got really dark and lightning. It was going to be a huge storm. It hadn't quite hit us yet, except for the wind. And just the feeling of that, sitting there, with that and the storm coming up, I just just played this riff. <laughs> it's a little stormy, <laughs> especially Second if you do this. <laughs> I liked it so much, I played it again. <laughs> Storm's still raging. I hear Alice Cooper say, Welcome to my nightmare. Think you're gonna like it. I think you're gonna feel like you belong. Mm, eternal vacation, unnecessary sedation. You know inside you feel like you belong. And then I wrote this riff. Sweat and laugh and scream here. Cause life 
life is just a dream here You know inside you feel right at home Welcome to my nightmare home Welcome to my that was how the song got started. <laughs> in a tropical storm with a little guitar riff, and then Alice Cooper coming up with that title out of, just out of the air. And, uh, you know, we, we recorded it, it became a, a multi million selling album. It was a 120 city tour of, all over the world. It was the, the biggest rock and roll tour of all times at that time. Became a, an ABC television special and a documentary film. And uh, it kept like 50 of us on the road for a year and a half in complete harmony. <laughs> you know, the band and the, I mean, it was just a tremendous time. And uh, we had great adventures and in my book, I talk about the whole thing and a lot, a lot of other things too. But that was one of my nightmares. Right. I think we wrote about a hundred songs of Alice, yeah. we wrote for years, and they, they wrote some recently.